everybody, it's me again, Rowena Tumada, and welcome to my YouTube channel! And for today's video, I will be doing a review of the most cool coverage foundation, and that is... Dermacool Derma Cool Foundation! And if you want to know my thoughts about this product, stay tuned! I'm back! Guys, I'm so excited because it's my first time to use this product. And guys, maybe you probably all know already about this product, but okay lang, kasi I want to know how it works for me, okay? You know guys, that day, I really suffered from severe acne, and I do have pores right now, that's why I would like to cover up with this. Now, let me show you this. Ito siya. It looks like this. Okay. I got this from an online store. I think around 899. I'm not sure if it is available sa Watson or other department stores. So tina natin. Oh, ang ganda ng packaging niya. And it has a couple of languages here at the back. Makikita mo merong I don't know kung anong mga dialects or lingua ito. Pero meron din namang English. So, basahin natin yung nakalagay. Um, Dermacool Film Studio Makeup Cover Waterproof SPF 30 and Hypoallergenic. Hmm, gusto ko yun. Yung hypoallergenic kasi sensitive talaga yung skin ko. So, kailan ko yung hypoallergenic. As far as I know, meron siyang 13 shades. Pero yung shade na nasa akin ay... 209 number 209 and then nakalagay din dito na side yung expiry date niya at least alam natin kung kailan siya mag-expire and then okay tingnan natin yung ano yung nasa loob I'm excited Ciao! so meron siyang leaflet sa loob tingnan natin eto yung leaflet niya sa loob so original talaga siya guys kasi makikita mo iba ibang languages ang nandi dito pero syempre meron din siya yung English of course kasi yun yung international na language ito pa yung leaflet leaflet niya and you will see a couple of uh, different languages in it so meron siyang kiniklaims dito so basahin ko muna hypoallergenic um, high cover. So, mamaya titingnan natin. Ito naman yung kanyang lalagyan or container. So, let's open it. Oh, it has a seal there. So, you can poke it with a cap. Ito siya. So, ito yung pang ipapoke natin siya. Like that. Ayan. So, na-open ko na siya. Ayan. So, let's start. There we go. Oh, ganito po siya. Ito, kita nyo ba? Can you see it? I hope so. So, let's start. And, I will be using this dumb sponge. Oh, I will start from the forehead. Going downward to the face. Ayan. So, very easy talaga siya i-blend. Hindi ito sa my chin na tayo banda. I like it. Yes. So, syempre, huwag din natin kalimutan lagyan yung under the eye. Pwede na rin siyang concealer at the same time. Ayan. At syempre guys, huwag din natin kalimutan itong dark circle sa under eye. Lagyan din natin siya. Ang ganda! Ang ganda nga. It really covers blemishes. Nakocover din niya yung pores ko. Amazing! 
Ayan. And so easy to blend talaga siya. Ang ginagamit ko kasi na foundation ay yung mga powder foundation. I also use um, liquid foundation but not that high coverage na kagaya nito. So, ang ganda. In fairness, ang ganda talaga niya sa face. Ayan. Actually, hindi nga masyadong marami yung nilagay ko. Kunti lang yung nilagay ko sa mukha. Kasi, ano eh, high coverage talaga siya. Yes. Ayan. Wow, grabe. I like it. Amazing. I really like it. Yeah. I really like it talaga as in. Promise. Ayan. Guys, huwag din natin kalimutan lagyan yung neck natin para pantay. Ayan. So amazing. I like it, guys. Ang ganda ni sa face. So guys, I'm done with the foundation. And next is I'm going to set this with powder and other makeup. Kaya, babalik lang ako. Sandali lang. Hi guys, I'm back. Now, meron akong makeup. At titingnan natin kung ano yung na-observe ko after putting makeup. Um, it really hides blemishes. Ayan. So, pati yung large pores ko, nako-cover up niya. Yes, amazing. I really like it. The best. Tapos, ano pa? Hindi siya heavy sa face. I don't see white cast right now. Walang heavy na feeling. As in, very nice talaga siya. I like it. Ayan. So, mas mabuti talaga siguro na I'll let it stay for how many hours para malaman talaga natin kung ano yung effect niya. So, babalik ako mamaya para malaman natin kung ano talaga yung effect niya sa face ko. Sandali lang. Hi guys! I'm back! And after a few hours of um, letting it stay on my face, ayan na! Titignan natin. Napapansin po guys na nag-oil up na ako. Ayan, nakikita niyo sa forehead. Banda. Nag-oil up na siya. Dito rin. At saka dito banda. Sa nose din meron na. Nag-oil up na. So, pero okay lang siya kasi glow pa rin yung skin ko. Tapos... Still, nakakover pa rin niya yung mga blemishes. Hindi natanggal yung foundation, which is really the best. Good talaga siya. Tapos, dahil okay siya, kasi it's so amazing, kasi hindi talaga nawala yung foundation. Tapos, yung pores, nakakover pa rin niya. Wala akong nakikita ang white cast sa face. Yeah, so, it's good. But guys, if you're someone who is not used to full coverage, I suggest na uh, don't use it on a daily basis. Because sometimes foundation like this can be more for TV or special occasions or events. Kasi high yung coverage niya. So napapansin agad yung face mo. Kahit sa malayo ka, talagang napapansin nila na you are using um, full coverage foundation. So, I suggest or I highly recommend na uh, you use this um, pag ano lang may mga special occasions or events but not on a daily basis. Yes, kasi parang very obvious kasi siya. So guys, that's it and I'm so happy kasi at last na try ko na siya and I hope you learned something today. So, don't worry sa mga iba pang details kasi uh, ilalagay ko sa description box. Okay? And if you have suggestions or comments, please comment down below. 
and please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and click nyo na rin ang notification bell para sa mga bagong pang updates. Yes. So that's all for today, and thank you for watching. Bye!